Hey fam, welcome back to the channel. I know I always start my videos like this, showing off the car, but uh, are you guys ready? Uh, I recently painted my wheels. Drop in the comments down below and let me know what do you guys think about this purple. Damn, I, I mean, they look good on different angles, but then, I don't know, I have like, mixed feelings about them uh, I just did it cuz I'm gonna record a video and um, some pictures uh, but then uh, eventually I'm gonna go back to gloss black and uh, go with the theme uh, with the carbon uh, fiber hood and carbon fiber trunk and uh, yeah like I mentioned before these wheels are temporary uh, these are not the wheels that are I will be having on the car. I'll be having um, the Workmeisters. So, that's that. Right now, I'm just gonna head over to my friend uh, where he's working. Uh, he took my uh, he took my stuff that I'll be using, my jack stands, and uh, yeah, so I'll be using those cause, uh, today. Today we'll be we will be doing the rear diffuser that I ordered from uh, Germany. Uh, you guys are gonna see it right now in a bit. Uh, I will show you guys uh, still in the box. So that's that. Uh, so I need to pick up some stuff for my friend's car. So I'm gonna head over where he's working right now. So stay with me and uh, hope you guys can watch the, the whole video. Uh, we will be doing the diffuser. Yeah. So. Um, I got it a uh, fiberglass and then uh, later on down the road I'll just be hydro dipping the diffuser so it can match the whole carbon fiber parts and yeah guys so uh, once again I want to say thank you to everyone everyone supporting the channel it is a dream come true uh, reaching my first 1k subscribers uh, to be honest I didn't expect to reach that goal uh, I mean it's it's hard when you start with like zero subscribers you're like I'm never I'm never gonna reach that goal but uh, thanks to you guys we are here we are about to reach the 1k subscribers and uh, yeah guys keep supporting the channel don't forget to um, click that subscribe button for me turn on your little bell for the notifications and uh, yeah so let's get the day started guys and uh, stay with me Again, uh, I haven't had time to come and organize this garage. Uh, it's just been working overtime and uh, time consuming and doing videos and all that stuff. Uh, I work like uh, 11, 12 hours a day, so I will get it at one point. But um, yeah, here's the, here's the rear diffuser. Let me take it off the box. Uh, probably move these wheels right here make some space right there so I can work uh, yeah so let's do that all right fam so this is the diffuser uh, I don't know what this is and I don't know what this is either so we're gonna open those uh, lay them right here on the floor and see what we have and uh, start checking the fitment to the rear end all right fam so first this is the first piece, the rear diffuser. I had to take off the rear license plate. So let's test it out. Let's see.
so this is a two people job just uh, test fitting this thing So I'm just waiting for my friend uh, to get here. He ordered the same uh, diffuser, so he's gonna be installing that one too. So I just gotta wait for him. Uh, this is a two people's job, so uh, we're gonna make some holes and yeah, so uh, let's wait up. And uh, get this thing going. I was waiting for this bitch right here. He recently got wheels. G. So fucking uh, this. Alright, so we're gonna start working on this. Bump. And then Do you have yours with you? Yeah, yeah. Do you have yours with uh to the user? Oh my nice. We just did uh the first hole right there. Uh we're gonna measure it right here how far from the bumper so that way we can uh, set it on and then uh, we're gonna make another hole on the other side but measure it with uh, the measurement tape so we're gonna do that right now so we're gonna try to explain the best we can because we've seen another well I've seen another YouTube videos where they just put it on and that's it they don't tell you uh, how to install it so Hope this can help you guys out. And uh, yeah, we're gonna be doing two diffusers today. So we're gonna be doing mine and his. So that's gonna be the whole thing. So. Yeah, and it's more. So one more, one more round. All right, so we're gonna put in the first bracket. So come on, so put it this way. Just like this, or see? See, let's put the other way around. Okay. You can go like this. Either way. All right, so uh, you need a washer on this one or no? Here, put just put this bitch on. Okay. It must like hand tie your phone. See me. And then I thought we go back. That's that. All right, so we're gonna put it in the bumper. All right, so this is. Uh, what we have right now we have bracket right here but I don't think we're gonna be using it we're just gonna go get a longer bolt or how do you call that shit? Screws. screws whatever the fuck so right now we got a bracket right here on the back that it goes over there I'll show you guys later where we put it on and uh yeah so right now uh Head to the storeway, get the bolts. So so that way we can put it on already on the front and then a bracket on the back and we're good to go. And then uh maybe we can put the side ones now. Yeah. So that's that for now, but damn that should look sick. So once we we come back I'll show you guys uh step by step. Cause like uh I'm saying like some videos on YouTube they don't explain how to do the bracket and what bolts to use so you're gonna see it here so let's head over to the store I'm so closing the garage right now check out the front almost touching the ground Damn. so we are heading to the store get some bolts because the ones that they sent they suck they need new ones alright so let's head over there Alright fam, so we are looking for some, uh, we might use this ones, 1, 4, 20 times 2. I don't know if these ones are going to be the ones we need, but uh, we can try. Let's see. <laughs> Alright fam, so we're going to go home and try this and uh, try to install the diffuser right now. See you. All right, let's 
So, all right, fam. So we just got back. Uh, we're gonna test this. This ones that we got. I don't know what they call bolts, screws, whatever the f f you want to call them. Hopefully, I mean, I don't know. Fuck. All right, fam. So we went to get this at O'Reilly's. Uh, they were one fourth by twenty something. What was the measurement? Uh, one fourth and by two. two inches. One fourth by two inches or something. And uh, it fits perfectly. Like, I mean, you don't need nothing else. Just put a that's, fucking. That's all you need uh, in the washer or the freaking. Uh, the nut. The nut. <laughs> <laughs> You need a nut in the back. Uh, you fucking hold it. You just need a nut on the back. <laughs> and that's it. So, yeah. So, we're going to put them on and damn, we're good to go. That's way you put them both on. Yeah. Hold that shit's holding on already. So, that shit's holding on already. So, we are good. This right here is That's the way we need to. Okay, yeah. Okay. So, here. Okay, so let's put them on and. Get the bracket on the back and you're good. All right, fam. So we just uh, finished putting this uh, front uh, screws, nuts, uh, whatever you want to call it. So they're good to go. I put the license plate like this. Uh, yeah, you can get pulled over. You gotta be careful with that. I don't mind. Whatever they can pull me over, I don't care. I just want my shit to be clean. <laughs> So there it is, and uh, yeah, so we're just gonna put the rear bracket from here, and good to go, and then we're gonna start on this one, so let's do it. Alright, so we're doing the rear bracket, so we're gonna cut it right now, there it is, and then we're gonna put it on the back right here, we got the hole already, so... So we're gonna do it. Alright fam, so this is the thing right here. You need to make a bracket for the back that attaches all the way to the back. I'll show you guys right now. And then you guys need this on the side. What was the measurement? What? The measurement on this. One fourth. One fourth or one sixth? Uh, I mean, it depends what people like. It was like uh one six. One six. Well, I mean one and a half. Like from here through here. So that's that. We also had a bracket here, so that attaches there and through here. Same as the back. So it's just tight. Fam, so check this out. This is uh, Chapo. Chapito. Chapo. Chapo. Come here, Chapo. Come here, Chapo. Damn, fucking milagro. Come bro. here, Chapo. He's not biting you no more. There you go, Chapo. Why well, we call him Chapito? So that's Chapito right there. All right, fam. So we're gonna start on the G35 
process should be the same so I don't think I'll be recording this I don't know maybe if anything different, we'll yeah if we see anything different I'll probably record it but yeah that's that for for the video install of the diffuser uh, yep so this, this actually has the oh this one's gonna light. it's gonna have the light uh, where's the thing so on this one that's the one I need to get for the G37 so is that the 370Z? 370Z yeah that's a 370Z brake light uh, fog light F1 light whatever F the fuck F1 light whatever you want to call it uh, someone told me it was the fog light for the rear but uh, I think it's just uh, yeah it's probably the fog light whatever it can be used more like a third brake light uh, let's show people how it's gonna look just if we don't show any install shit uh, damn that thing looks sexy as fuck Boom! Straight out. So what about the light? Looks like it's heating, fool. This will work. Might have to cut the bumper. Fuck it, let's get it. Alright, let's, let's get onto it. Alright, so... Here it is. Chupito. Alright, fool. Alright, fam. So, just in case if I don't finish the video, I'm gonna finish here with Chupito. So, there it is. Also, I want to thank uh, Imaya on Instagram. That's, that's your Instagram for? Imaya805. Imaya805. So, thanks for the install. Uh, we're going to do that right now on his. So, don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys to the next one. Yeah.